Meanwhile, President Bola Ahmed Tinubu says the regional bloc will continue to champion diplomacy and dialogue as well as earnest discussions with all parties involved to restore constitutional governance in the Republic of Niger. The ECOWAS chairman spoke at the opening of the second extraordinary summit on the socio-political situation in the Republic of Niger going on in Abuja on Thursday. Tinubu stressed the importance of a comprehensive evaluation of progress thus far underscoring the significance of the meeting. Building upon commitments from the initial extraordinary summit held in Abuja 10 days ago, President Tinubu recollected the ECOWAS leader's collective condemnation of the military coup that toppled Niger's democratically elected government. Including the coup leaders, in earnest discussion to convince them to relinquish power as suggested and reinstate President Bazoum. It is our duty to exhaust all avenues of engagement to ensure a swift return to constitutional governance in Niger. The ECOWAS chairperson expressed confidence that the second extraordinary summit would be a defining moment in the journey towards a stronger, more resilient and integrated West Africa. He therefore rallied fellow leaders to seize the opportunity to make a lasting impact on the lives of Africans by fostering a future characterized by peace, progress and prosperity. Regrettably, the seven-day ultimatum we issued during the fourth summit has not yielded the desired outcome. 